hello guys what's up welcome back to my channel we are vlogging and i completely forgot to change out my battery so we're starting off this vlog with no battery so i'm assuming these clips are gonna be very short but if you're new here my name is bianca you should definitely subscribe i'm headed to a workout um i'm um it's noon i had my morning actually i had a very slow morning um and by that i mean i woke up at six to feed sun which is new for us because we've been doing like 8 a.m feeds and then Sutton and I fell back to sleep and um we both slept till 10. so now I'm going to a noon workout I'm thinking you were made for me it's in my birthday yeah, cause I gotta say you're looking like a gift for me wrapped up nice and neat baby get in my way now don't be shy we'll be here dancing day and night get in my groove now don't be shy cause I got this list of my favorite things you could be the part where it all begins you could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it computer work um doing a no makeup day today since it's already later in the day and we're not going anywhere so um yeah just staying cozy but we did just get our thrive market box just showed up at the door so i wanted to show you guys what was in it and obviously thank thrive market for sponsoring today's video in case you have not heard me talk about thrive yet thrive market is an online membership based grocery store and they are on a mission to make healthy living easy and affordable for everybody which is one of the main reasons why colin and i love it because you can get name brand things off of thrive that you would see at more high-end grocery stores for instance whole foods and places like that less expensive which is huge because they sell organic foods and natural products below traditional retail prices you can also search under certain dietary needs so if you're gluten-free paleo vegan everything like that you can just customize your search bar and it will show a bunch of different options any dietary restrictions you may have which is pretty cool it makes shopping really really easy and they have a wide variety of things they've got snacks meats beauty items stuff for pets stuff for household situations like cleaning or even like storage like okay i'm going to show you in a minute because i will go through everything that i got but i'm so excited about one of the things that i got for a storage situation there's just a wide variety of things that you can get from thrive market which in that which is another reason why i think it's so worth it because at one point you're gonna need paper towels you're going to need cleaning supplies dish soap all the things they have it all you can pay monthly and it'll be 9.95 a month or you can do the year membership which is what we have we get a box every single month that ends up being 59.95 for the whole year but then the breakdown of that would have been five dollars a month so in my opinion that's the best deal and i also have a little promo for you guys if you go to thrivemarket.com slash bianca henderson then you can get 40 percent off of your first order and you can also get a free gift so we love to see it and then as we all know my all-time favorite part about thrive market is every new annual membership so it just says it right here on the box but it sponsors a free year of a membership for a family in need so also 100 recyclable and set with carbon neutral shipping it even tells you who it was packed by so it's very personal very authentic and i'm obsessed tried to get new things so first I'm like a sucker for the Thrive Market chips as we know so this time we're trying out their blue corn tortilla chips which is perfect because Colin and I I think are cooking Mexican themed stuff tonight either tonight or tomorrow I don't know um and then to go with the chips also like the blue corn chips, I don't know what it is, but they, in my opinion, are superior. I just really like when they're the blue corn chips. But, okay, so I got the Thrive Market Organic Salsa in Medium. This was just speaking to me. I just really felt like I wanted to get it. So I got chips and salsa, but also Colin and I cook um, Mexican all the time. So I knew that we would use it. Okay, another new thing. 
this looked really really good it's the cilantro lime dressing um from primal kitchen which i see this brand literally everywhere um and it's nice to just get a discount on it but it's the cilantro lime dressing and marinade um, with avocado oil i thought that would be good okay i got some seventh generation cleaning wipes because we are running low on our cleaning wipes so just a little restock this is the storage thing i was so excited about you guys know i'm on an avocado toast kick i got an avocado hugger so this like keeps your avocado really good because i only really use one like side at a time and so then my other side always gets a little weird before the next time i use it so i ordered this off thrive and when i saw it i was like oh my god i need to have it and there's like two different sizes in case you have a massive avocado or like a normal size avocado and then you just slip it over the side that you're not using and it has the little hole for the little seed part what is that what is what is that called what is the center of an avocado don't even worry because i just remembered that it's called the pit of an avocado i'm glad i could have figured that out because if not i was gonna feel like a dummy Okay, and then two more things. So I mentioned this in a vlog, but I want to try out their matcha. So I got Thrive Market's Organic Tea Matcha. It's ceremonial grade, which I always try and get ceremonial grade. It's just like a higher grade of matcha. Um, but I'm very excited to try this out. And then I have a little treat yourself moment going on, which I might use this literally today. But it's the Acure um, Welcome to Skin Wellness Seriously Soothing mask there's another word on here but it's really long so i'm like not even gonna attempt to say it you can read it if you want it starts with the b um but yeah they have face masks they literally have everything on there so i cannot recommend enough to hop on the thrive market chain also to help support a family in need and also all the good things that comes with thrive market so thrivemarket.com slash bianca henderson to get 40 percent off of your first order plus a free gift worth 50 dollars so many good things come in your thrive box including a free gift if you use a little promo so i hope you guys enjoyed my little thrive haul and thank you again thrive for sponsoring today's video i love working with you guys and we're gonna continue on with our little evening what time is it Three five for catching up on the johnny depp trial are you ready to get up murphy's ready for us to get up i think he misses us are you ready for us to move and get up and do things all right you want to take her yeah what are we going to do today? What are we going to do today? Wait, are you leaving today? Yeah. Oh, man. That's going out of town today. So it's just me and you. So, we're going to... What? Did you... Oh, I... Drop the passy. There you go. Okay, so, update. Little button muffin still in newborns. So that's nice and exciting, even though she's almost two months. It makes me really, really happy. And I'm going to shower and wash my hair, but first I'm letting Colin get ready. Um, Colin's going out of town today to South Carolina where he's gonna be filming the film next month. And I don't know what they're doing, but they're doing stuff like behind the scenes director stuff because he's, um, I think he's the DP. Hey, what are you on this film, a DP? Are you DPing this film? Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm, I'm recording. DP is director of photography. Yeah. Okay. See, I'm learning these things. Ow, that boob hurts. Oh no, I think I need to pump. I'm trying to get my milk supply up, and sometimes like my boob just sprays milk like randomly. Like it gets really hard. Well, I'm about to get into the shower. Or, so well, yeah, I know. It gets like I feel this like it's not necessarily like a pain, but I feel like pressure in my boob. In, in both boobs most of the time and then all of a sudden if I'm like in the shower and it happens they just start spraying so I'm assuming that's what happens in my bra and then my bra just like keeps it all in there but anyway it's weird it only ha started happening like what around the time when I need to feed her but we just fed her so it's not that time yet or like now that I've been trying to get my milk supply back up but anyway so you cannot stare at daddy naked <laughs> She was looking right at me. Get in the shower, you weirdo. I'm getting in the shower. Okay, so I'm going to try out this Thrive Market matcha this morning um, and see how it is. Since Colin is going out of town, my mom is coming over when he leaves to help me out with um, both Murphy and Sutton because that's just like a lot to handle um, all together. So she's coming over to help me out with that and I'm going to make... This matcha. So I'll tell you guys how I like the powder. 
I showed how I make my matcha in my morning routine video, so if you want to go see, check it out. I used a different matcha, that's the only thing that's different. Um, I used Art of Tea instead of Thrive. So I'm gonna give this a shot. I'm sure it'll be good though. She said that she got like some dinner at Costco, so I'm assuming she's bringing over like a Costco yeah. meal. Yeah, are you excited to see Gigi? She's gonna come over and hang out with us. She is. I'm excited. Wow. Oh, can you smile for the camera? Can you go? Oh, oh, it's not funny anymore. Sorry. I thought it was funny. Dang. Okay. Whoops. Matcha audience. Excuse me, you need to go make sure she's okay. Good boy. Just good boy. <laughs> I end up doing the cold foam on top, even though it looks like it. Um, excuse me, I'm very bright. But I did try and like froth the milk, so I guess I did do something different, but I would recommend doing it the other way that I did it in my other vlog, because um, the milk is kind of weird. But the matcha tastes really good. It doesn't taste like grass at all. And it has like a little minty kick, in my opinion. It's really, really good. have to be your biggest fan and when things are really tough and they're really rough and nothing's working but there's something inside of you that says I just have to follow that because you don't know who you're gonna meet who you're gonna meet who you're gonna meet doing tummy time a little bit later than usual today i still have the trial on in the background i should probably go turn that down but colin just left for south carolina my mom is on her way over and murphy just brought me his frog <laughs> but um yeah we're just hanging out in here i didn't end up doing tummy time this morning because i wanted to like shower and wash my hair and take the time to do that and like kind of flip flop when we did tummy time. And I did like a little montage, but I did get in a huge haul from Abercrombie. So I'm going to try it all on whenever I get a chance. Might be tomorrow or the next day. I really don't know. But um, I am waiting on like one more tank top from them, but it's just a black tank top and I got it in another color too. So it's not that big of a deal, but it's just a bunch of like basics stuff that I can wear with multiple different outfits. And I'm really excited about the haul and I really hope that a bunch of it fits. So we'll see. This is like my first order from Abercrombie that I've done since it became popular again. So I'm excited to try it out. In my like past couple vlogs, I feel like I've kept saying like Sutton's been fussy and so I stopped recording. It was always like around the evening. Well, check out my, okay, well, it's kind of a mess right now, but this is quite the uh, getting ready set up if I do say so myself. Body armor, pump makeup which i'm done with now hello it's the next day i've got quite the story to tell you guys i got mastitis that night again for the third time now so um i talked with a like lactation consultant and they helped me out a lot so there's a few things that i'm changing first being the way that i feed her um i always do like a football hold but now i'm just doing like the normal like across the body um she liked the football hold a lot so that's why i did it but we just had to get her used to doing it a different way so changing that up they think that the first time I got it my mastitis just never fully healed so that's why I've gotten it back to back like the previous times now for like that making it three times so hopefully we are not gonna get it again but who knows I don't know if I'm just more prone to getting it or what but 
yeah, anyways, talked to them and we figured it out. So that's on that. But whole new day. So I pretty much just took all day yesterday off because I did not feel good. I'm doing a quick little apartment pickup and tidy. And then I want to show you guys those Abercrombie clothes and just get on with the things. I thought I'd come into our bedroom and do a little haul. Where is he? I don't know how this is going to go because he's in here. But we, I just like never spend time in our bedroom anymore. One, because it's honestly so dark in here, but the lighting's really good right now. So that's good to know. Um, but there's a balcony like in front of our bedroom. So we, one, just, it's just always super dark in here. And two, remember those things that I made? I hate them. So I think we're going to get rid of them today. Like just throw them away, toss them. It was a DIY plaster thing. And the plaster is like cracking and falling off. And it's just not turning out how I expected it. And there's not a really thing back there. But just ignore that. Anyways, um, our TV broke. So eventually we're going to get a new TV. But now like this whole credenza isn't even decorated. So um, that's like something I want to work on. Plus, um, I've got like four things that I want to work on on the apartment except we're about to leave to go to South Carolina for a month so there's like no point in doing it now but I want to finish that I want to get a matching mirror for the other side of the couch um which I might do that might be like the first thing on my list I want to get a bookshelf like a tall bookshelf for the nursery for her books and stuff I just haven't really found one that I like yet or one that's like inexpensive not I don't want to pay like hundreds of dollars for it you see what I'm saying and then so I've been like checking Facebook marketplace and then um so I usually put my drying racks there for whenever I wash my clothes and like whatever I'm putting on the drying rack I put my drying racks in that like little corner in the kitchen and I want to get two Billy Oxford Oxberg bookcases from Ikea and put them there like white ones so we can put storage down below because that's covered and it's not glass it's just wood and then the top part's glass so then I can style it really cute and then hopefully like in the next place we have like a little dining room and I can have our dining table with the bookcases and like style them really cute so I can see me using those pieces for a long time so I'm like really into it and then also same thing with the couch and the mirror like I always kind of want to have that situation because I really like it but I don't know what our next living space is going to look like so it's a little bit difficult but those are the last like final things that I want to do in this apartment and also probably do something with my closet but at this point it's just a really lost closet in my opinion so yeah anyway I wanted to do a little like collective haul if you will so it's very little trust me I'm just going to show you guys things that I got sent things that I bought all of the actually this is the only thing I got sent I think the other stuff I need for like videos but bump suit which oh don't even tell me this is dead anyways bump suit um sent me a ton of clothes to wear while I was pregnant and I literally wore them all the time it was like the jumpsuits and a pair of leggings I wore all the time um that came up over the bump I just really like bump suit a lot and I think it's either my discount code's Bianca or Bianca 20 I believe is what it is do you want me to get out but they sent me a nursing bra and I really like it. I wore it for the past couple days and it's just like your generic nursing bra. It's sturdy though so I need to wash it and it unhooks but it is so soft and I really like it. And I like how this strap is really thin on a lot of other nursing bras. This strap is like more thick so I like the thin strap a lot. And then I also like the back is just it's just a really supportive bra like I don't know of how many clasps on the back makes it any more supportive but I just found it to be really supportive and now it has dog hair all over it so I need to wash it but they sent that and then I'm really excited about this they sent like a little waist trainer thing um which just kind of helps hold everything in so especially like when I'm wearing clothes out and about now I'm totally gonna wear this under pretty much everything honestly um so I'm really excited to try this out but this just kind of like slips over and just kind of like holds everything together um so I think that also if you're about to have a baby this would be really nice for right away the suit has a ton of pregnancy things like really cute clothes for if you're pregnant and then a lot of postpartum like essentials like nursing bras and stuff like that so if you're pregnant I would definitely check them out plus I have a discount code I'm pretty sure it still works okay so then also from set active i made my first set active order post baby so they came out with this color macadamia for the from their hawaii collection and so murphy so i got the sporty suit um in a medium 
and it's like it's just the shorts i'm pretty sure it's called the sporty suit but you know what i haven't bought anything from set active in so long but it's the sport body material um i'm really excited about this and then i am just so obsessed with neutrals that i also bought the set which um i just kind of had to have so i got the leggings in medium too and then really when they were when i was pregnant they came out with this high neck sports bra and so i wanted to try this out maybe i can wear this now while i'm pregnant but i got it in a medium and i probably need a large so i need to try it on i'm kind of scared to try it on but just because yeah I want to feel confident but this will definitely fit me after for sure I'm breastfeeding but I don't know we'll give it a shot um it seems like really stretchy and nice but I did get a medium so we'll see but I think that the high neck style is super cute and I'm really excited to try it out I finally bit the bullet and I ordered this Lux unfiltered um gradual self tanner I've wanted it for a really long time and since summer's coming up I figured now would be a good time to try it out plus I just feel most confident when I'm tan Oh my god, that smells so good. Okay, I'm really excited about this. Okay, and then this is like a TikTok made me buy it situation. This is called the um, bedhead stick. And um, apparently it's like really good for when you want to slick your hair back. So I'm going to give this a shot. Oh my god, it smells so good. Anyway, so like when you do slick back ponytails and stuff, because that is what I wear a lot during the summer is slick back buns and slick back ponytails because of how like hot and humid it is here. I just don't even bother doing my hair a lot of the times or I'll do it like wavy like this because it gets really frizzy anyway. Um, like I waved my hair today because my hair was just already kind of wavy and like frizzy and stuff. So I was like, whatever, I'm not going to like curl it and try and style it. I'm just going to throw some waves in. So yeah, waving my hair is a go-to for me during the summer. But anyway that's that so got this for the stroller and it's so funny because my friend abigail um tagged me in this on tiktok and i was like oh my god i have to order it so then i ordered it and then it's literally so funny because some of you guys must have seen the same tiktok um because you guys a lot of you guys tagged me in it too and it is a cup holder for your stroller because the nuna doesn't come with a cup holder like with the stroller you would have to get one separately and it also has a phone case holder so where's my phone um, the best part about this is it fits a Stanley Cup. So I'll show you guys. I'm sure we'll go on a walk tonight and I'll show you guys how it works because I need to put it on my stroller. But I have the iPhone um, 13 Pro. Yeah. And it fits my phone. And there's even room. So I'm pretty sure it would fit a Pro Max. Like there's room on the side. Also, I like never come in here because Colin and I used to have this rule of like the last person who gets out of the bed makes the bed. And it's always Colin. So he always makes the bed, but he just hasn't been making the bed lately. So I made it today. And I just already feel so much better about everything. So I think, first of all, too, today we woke up at like 10 because we didn't go to bed until like 2 last night because it was just like a big ordeal. Like you just with little fussy. Yeah. What are you doing? You're not supposed to be over here. I'm getting very tired of not waking up early because um, I got into that really good routine of waking up at like 7.30 and pumping and then I would like pitch it back to 8 and then it kind of got pushed back to 8 and then like 8.30 and now I just need to get back on a schedule again. I'm not feeling good about myself at all. Anyways. Oh my god. I thought, look at how, if you guys, like I know that you can't see him in person but he is such a big dog. Like look at our heads next to each other. Oh my god, your breast smells so bad. If you see, if you ever could see Murphy in person, I think you guys would be like, holy cow. Like, he is literally, a, he's a big dog. Hey. <gasps> Are you ready for my Abercrombie haul? cup holder thing though is on my amazon storefront underneath baby now for the big okay i'm not gonna lie you guys i like really treated myself because you guys know i've been struggling a lot with postpartum my body and clothes and figuring out what to wear every day so i got some basic staple pieces that i can wear with a bunch of different outfits and um i just am excited to show you guys this haul plus i got a pair of jeans i got three pairs of pants one pair of jean shorts and a pair of jeans and a pair of like linen no not even linen they're like the dress pants kind of yeah if they don't fit now they will one day but i just really wanted to try them out so anyways i will have all of this stuff linked in the description box first things first i did get a bathing suit because i'm more than positive that we're going to the beach with collins family the unfortunate thing about this is i ordered a medium and they sent me an extra small so 
that's an issue <laughs> and I am going to be returning these but here's the bottoms it's like a pink um it's like a purplish pink is this seersucker like what do you call this I'm going to try them on just for like shits and gigs but there's no way that this is fitting me actually no there's no way I don't know I'll keep you updated okay let me show you the top though it's really cute but I did want to get a bathing suit this is why did I get this in a medium I definitely should have got this in a large this is one of those things that might be returned to in exchange for a different size because I actually really like it unless it doesn't look good on oh my god I don't think there's any way that my boob is fitting in this but here's the top it looks a little confusing right now but I just thought it would be really cute but I might need something more supportive too yeah I don't know if this is gonna fit it would have definitely fit my old body I think I should have gotten a medium or a large yeah we're gonna be exchanging that for a different size probably okay next up I've seen this dress everywhere so I had to get it plus I really liked this brown color but it's their traveler mini dress and I got a medium I figured that this would be good for the summer especially because of like the walks and stuff and there's built-in shorts so I thought it'd be really really comfortable oh oh my god there's a little slit for your phone um, but yeah, I've just seen these everywhere. So I got this really cute brown color. One of the pairs of pants that I got. So these are the 7 inch, for some reason I thought they were the 6 inch. The 7 inch dad short high rise and I ordered a size 28. Um, but I saw someone on TikTok get these and they looked really, really cute on her. So I wanted to try them out. Okay, next, let's just go down the line with the pants. Okay. Next thing is the dad high rise and this is the curve love. I really wanted to get like the 90s curve love pants but they were sold out. So I'm going to try out these. They're the dad high rise. Not for you. Um, but I really like them. They're just a light wash and I got them because I thought that the thighs looked a little bit bigger and my thighs are a little bit bigger right now. So that is why I chose to get these. So we'll see. I literally haven't tried any of this stuff on though. I'm like opening it right now. So we will see. We will see. We will see. Okay. Last pair of pants. Um, had my eye on a different pair of pants similar to this, but they were also sold out. They were doing like a huge sale plus. Um, I had tw an additional 25% off because of my birthday. So now Abercrombie's like one of my new favorite stores, but there's like a weird looking plane flying above us. But, oh, these will definitely fit. I got a medium okay but I did want these to be a little oversized actually I say this now and then I'm gonna put it on my body and they're probably gonna be tight <laughs> I'm like what but they're this really cute cream color what are these do you have a name they're like a trouser flare trouser there we go that's the word I'm looking for but they have a pocket and pants like this are super and I've got nothing that looks like this so yeah I'm hoping that those are a success but who knows these days um they're not even like fancy tops they're all like casual t-shirts and tanks but that's like all i feel like wearing nowadays so we're gonna make casual we're bringing back casual casual is in for me okay so i got this gray t-shirt and this is like exactly what i wanted i got this in multiple colors because how cute would this be with jeans and just like my new balances super, and like a hat super simple but super cute so i got this gray t-shirt Yo, my stomach hurts i don't know why Um, and then I got it in black and these are all in a medium. I don't know my sizing is kind of weird too. So I got this one and then I think I also got it in tan. Oh my God. Did I actually do that? Also, um, they, it shipped separately and I have no idea where it is. It might be in the mailbox, but, and I just haven't went and looked yet, but, um, I also got a black tank top. It just shipped separately from all this stuff. So then I got the t-shirt again in brown because guys know if you know I love the color brown um and this has like the cute little button up it's like a Henley oh my god wait I actually thought that this was gonna be a full-size tank top and not like a crop but I wanted to get oh well, that's hilarious I was like I don't want to order crop tops there's no way that I would have ordered this if it said yeah there okay this is not classified as a crop top on the website but here it is it's just a little tank top I guess everyone wears crop tops nowadays so if this white one's a crop I'm really sad I just wanted like full length tank tops okay so it's definitely like more cropped but do you hear Colin to find something out there that's cute 
Um, okay, we're gonna have to try this one on too. This is a, okay, then this one's in a small because they didn't have a medium. So, God, I'm really hoping that this ends up working out. I think it'll be fine. No, I don't know. We'll give it a shot. Anyways, that's my haul. Murphy wants to go out there and play with them. Um, so besides that, like, that's everything I got. And then the black tank top. But the black tank top, um, looks just like that tan one I just showed you. But without the buttons, it's just a scoop neck. Okay, so here's the gray t-shirt. Which, it comes down to about, like, here. And then I can just, like, tuck it in or bra tuck it or whatever. So that fits. And then here's the shorts. So they're just a little tight, but I could button them. So that's a good sign. So I'm definitely going to keep these, and then you could roll them too. But everyone's in here for my try-on haul. Hi. Are you sticking your tongue out? Are you sticking your tongue out? Also, the bathing suit did not fit. I'm going to exchange it, and then I'll try it on again when like the new sizes come. But it's cute. It's just too small. Here's the dad jean. And... I really like these, and they're stretchy, which is perfect. My nose itch is really bad. I'm not picking my nose, I swear. Um, okay, yeah, the dad jean is a 10 out of 10 for me. I really like it. I'm impressed. Cute. Okay, I love these pants. I feel like they're the perfect length, and I think they'd be really cute with, like, heels, too. So these are really, really good black t-shirt I'm obsessed with the black one but I do love the color black but I really like the black one a lot too so yeah here's black let me put on the brown brown's cute too okay these are gonna be good staples for sure um and you can wear them like underneath blazers and stuff it, I think it'll be really good it's the tan tank I actually like it and I the crop length isn't like super cropped you know like it's not up to here so I think it'll be fine with jeans and stuff, but I do think it's like a flattering cut, if you see what I'm saying. I'm looking at you. And see my bra straps, but um, I need to get like a strapless nursing bra. Do they even have those? Probably not. So probably just need to get a new strapless bra, but, because I wear those a lot during the summer, but um, I'm actually kind of glad that I got the small in this tank top, because it fits fine. So that's good. And, yeah, I like this tank top a lot, especially with these pants. It's really cute. Um, yeah. So, it's a bit of a look. Here's a little workout dress. I literally thought I was going to rip it trying to get it over my hips. Because my hips are just more wide now. But, um, now that it's on, it's really cute. I really like it. Here's the back. I took off my nursing bra. So, hopefully my boobs don't leak everywhere. But, um, yeah, I really like it. I really like the color. The material is different than I thought it was going to be. It's more of like a lightweight material, and I thought it would be more of like a spandexy material. Um, like, it's that material, whatever material makes that sound. Um, but I thought I just broke a nail. It's good, I think. Yeah. Anyways, I do like it. Um, I know that they have dupes on Amazon, so I might try out the Amazon dupes and then compare it for you guys. Just because this one's like $40 and then the ones on Amazon are obviously less expensive. So I might do that and kind of do a little comparison. Okay, here's the Macadamia Sporty Suit. I usually wear a bra underneath. Um, my one that I have now that's a medium is a lot more loose than this one. So I don't know if they changed up their sizing or whatever. But it's okay. Um, so here's what it looks like on... I don't really feel like the most confident in it right now, but it's okay. So this high neck sports bra, when I am done breastfeeding, I'm going to love. Trust me. Um, here's the set on me now. Obviously, a lot different than I used to look, but that's okay. Okay, so sport body isn't as like huggy any as um, Sculpt Flex is, but here's a little side view. Here's a good little postpartum body update for you. Two months. Um, after birth but anyway okay I love the top and the high neck like this is probably going to be one of my new favorite bras that they have and then here's the leggings actually they're a little bit see-through I just need to work on my post pardon body and then we'll be kicking it in this set but here it is two months after the baby so when I have this sit on again in like a year come talk to me this is just going to be a good before thing for us but it is super comfy and I really like this fabric a lot because it's really, really soft. 
put the cup holder on. So testing it out. Fits my water. Oh, hold on. In the phone. Oh my gosh, amazing. Here it is. I need to like fix it just a little bit more because it's a little crooked, but it definitely fits. And here's my little outfit. Just wearing the gray t-shirt and the dad jeans and my new balances. Um, we're going to Target. We're out of diapers, like literally out. We need to go get diapers. So we're taking a family trip to Target. I probably could have just went, but we're just all going to go. I think Colin has to pick up some things anyway. And we need toothpaste, toothpaste and diapers. And then we buckle that a little bit. And then we pull your army out over here a little. We wash the strappies just like that. We dust the cheekies just like that. We just do the dummy just like that. We just do cheekies just like that. Oh, oh no. no. It's okay, sweet girl. It's okay. Murph, we gotta go bye bye. He looks comfy. Mm -hmm. You comfy, bud? Is that a good spot for you? Yeah. Got my coffee. Whoa. Do you hear me? Oh, those? I don't think we need any right now. No, we don't, but just yeah. really rude. Okay. We're getting diapers. The paper towel rolls aisle is non-existent stocking up on body armors and Colin got some bang and I'm trying an ollie pop we're we're getting it we're doing it what you doing <laughs> that was a successful target trip I had to get one fun thing, which was the candle. I could have done way more damage if I wanted to, but I didn't because I just damaged that Abercrombie. I had Colin take my Instagram picture though because I am coming out with a new preset for summer. It's essentially, it's similar to my warm and moody um, preset, but this one's gonna be called warm and natural because it's a lot less edited than the warm and moody. So if you like the edited look, then I would go for warm and moody and if you like the natural look like how like bring casual back to instagram is basically what people are doing now then i would go for that and then i also have my story preset which i'm coming out with too which i'm excited about because um a lot of the time people ask how i edit my story so i just made it into a preset instead of just doing it every time on my phone so I think those will be launched by the time you guys see this video too. So if you go in the description box, my presets are always linked. But then if you want to like remember where to get them or whatever, they're all they're also on my website. There's like a whole tab for presets. Excuse our mess, but these two are playing hide and seek or whatever you want to call it. We're home, set and eating. See guys, I breastfeed, I swear to God. I don't just bottle feed, we do both. Um, and then we're gonna go to the D-O-G-P-A-R-K. Um, do I need to give you a Target haul? I think I already did in the cart. The only fun thing was the candle and the Olipop, which I need to, will you go put all those body armors and bangs and drinks in the fridge for you? Mm -hmm. Oh. What? outside because Colin is cooking right now but the last thing you saw was me changing Sutton guys I was on such a struggle bus so she blew out while I was feeding her which was nuts and then I changed her and then I guess I like put the diaper on terrible I don't know I've like never had that happen to me before and she peed and it like seeped through the diaper in the crack and her whole bottom was wet so then I had to change her again and she was getting so annoyed with me so we were just a mess also Colin's making hibachi again for dinner and so um I'll have the recipe that he uses linked below because he just follows this recipe and he's just kind of like perfected it now 
Um, but it's so good. And I know a couple of you guys are interested in the recipe, so I will have it below. So I got a new camera if you guys are new here, so that's why it's different. So I'm going to try my best to edit this video and make it normal. But hopefully after this clip, the sound will be normal because I just remembered I forgot to ask him to fix it before I started filming this clip. And now it's far too late. But I was going to do this tonight. I'm too tired though. What I am going to do though is this face mask because I have clothes that are currently in the dryer and I washed all of my nursing bras and so I like have to wear a nursing bra to bed so I can put a pad in it or else my boobs will like leak everywhere so I'm gonna do this face mask while I wait for my bras to dry oh frick that's the worst but I wanted to give you guys a little update on my milk supply I feel like it's gone back up so what I did because I felt like it dropped or it regulated, but because she started sleeping through the night when it regulated, it, it didn't regulate enough um, for her and how much she drinks. So I had to kind of get it back up. So I've been drinking a body armor a day and I've been eating those Munchkin um, milk maker cookies that I got from Target in one of the last vlogs. That's what I've been doing and um, in between feeds, I was pumping for a little bit, but now I don't do that anymore because I think that my milk supply is back up. Anyway, I'm going to do this mask, but I think that my milk supply is, in fact, back up. So this is the mask that was in my Thrive Up Market pack. It's soft and then sometimes they're just like way too much work, so I don't want to do it. Okay. I guess I just have like a small face. Like what? Wait, I figured it out. There was a part that you like had to remove. Okay. I'm gonna go get the reaction. Ew, wait. Look at this face mask. Look at mom's face. Good morning, you guys. It's the next morning, and I forgot to update you on the face mask, but I liked it a lot. My skin felt really good after, so yeah, I didn't have like a reaction or anything to it, so that is good. But I'm going to end this vlog. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you again to Thrive Market for sponsoring this video. And hopefully in the next vlogs to come, my audio will be fixed. But I'm going to try and do my best to adjust it while I'm editing this video. So I'm going to have Colin look at my camera and fix the audio. And it'll all be better. But I'm sorry about that. But thank you guys so much for watching. And everything you need to know for Thrive will be linked in the description box below. And I will see you guys in my next video.